I believe we might have their quotes ready. Yeah. Let's take a look at what they had to say before getting into it. Urian is busted, and my opponent is strong, <laughs> so I'm hoping luck is on my side. I will say he's also a cheater. He does have certain power-ups. He does have the, the new father power-up, which has oh, done great. Right. Yeah, 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 has yeah. done mm -hmm. wonders. For the likes of the like CPT. Sako and J Justin, you know, oh, the, yeah. the, the dad power up. The dad right? power up, man. Yeah, even one of our producers here with the dad power up oh, recently, man. you know. <laughs> Damn right. Let's take a look at what TB had to say about Samyak going into it. Uh, if I win, I outplayed my opponent. If I lose, it's because Yuria needs, but the classic I option love it. select. That is the that classic is the FGC ad lib sheet that people fill in in their time <laughs> to wait for brackets, right? You could literally <laughs> underline the name Yuria and replace it with anybody else. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Especially top tier. This is the By classic the option select right mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Without so a doubt in my mind. If I win, it's me. That That's the low tier hero status, right? I mean, that's why... People like me were big low tier hero <laughs> fans. You know, when you win, you're like, ha, you totally, I totally beat you with this character, which means I'm better than you. And if I lose, it's just like, I'm supposed to lose my character. Bad, <laughs> you know, so, you know, it's, it's and, a, and that's, that's the weird thing. We, we kind of like to harp on this every single time we get onto CBT. I feel like it's in such a good place right now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, mm -hmm. you know, everybody's pretty viable. Everybody's pretty viable. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and again, like I said, with the character list that we see, we've had every character represented in top 16 now. I think the entire cast during the course of this year, every single character has been represented. I think we were waiting for a Honda, right? We were waiting for a Honda. We got we got that yeah, wish fulfilled. Uh, we got that wish fulfilled. And yeah. Yurian, I mean, with the China region, he definitely oh, yeah. he definitely overstayed his welcome a little bit. But you know, here with DC, he is. especially with DCQ, yeah. <laughs> But let's see how Somniac can handle this matchup here. As he said, Yurian is a strong character. We all know how strong this character is, but very beatable. Not even as strong as he was last year. On top of having a very competent opponent as well. Man, making his way through, caught the counter hit as well. Ooh. But uh, now just making a lot of reads based off of movement, taking Ooh. down Somniac, at least pushing him to the corner little by little. But right. Somniac does have an activation mountain to trigger. Let's see what happens if he can make the most of it. And it's interesting, too, because you didn't see Somniac punish the whiff EX chariot tackle, mm -hmm. which, like, China region was Ooh, so wee. good at because they've seen that move a thousand times. Yeah, and they memorized the space into the team. <laughs> but I will say Somniac opts to go Ooh. for moving a lot. Ooh, not quite not dead yet. dead yet. Oh, the throw. And you know what's funny, too, because I've always said this in all the CPTs, you can see at the end of the round, the shimmy is the most powerful tool. But Somniac was like, nah, I'm just going for the throw. And, and it, he was right. And what an option, too, the tick throw, especially the kind of put that message into TB's head. If he's put in that same situation, I feel like Somniac is going to go for the actual throw bait. But we'll see if it even gets there, right? TB Dude, has been blocking a lot, yeah. a lot of great life. And look at the big exchange. Hey, that's actually great for TB because he actually spent that meter to catch Somniac off guard and pretty much gain the momentum and the life lead as well. Right. Oh. All right. Backing off. Both of them backing off. And so there you see Bison. Somniac using the EX Cycle Ball. Classic Man. way to get in. And still catching TB off guard. Ooh, Ooh here he tried it. But he didn't have the meter for any V trigger, so he didn't get anything neat off of that yet. Still hasn't built it up yet. There it is. Now Aegis Reflector mm -hmm. is ready to go. But we'll and see if TB's even going to use it yet. I mean, he will if he gets it confirmed. Now he's going to probably have to. Yeah, the oh, life lead is no, now gone. What side? What side? Oh, he's not going to go. He is. There was. Woo! Okay, okay. Ooh. Oh, it's way too close to comfort. Oh no, just a tiny little bit of the same You saw it! Yeah. You saw it, right? Somniac was setting up for the whiff throw. Ugh. But now it's gonna be TB goes for the reset and the throw to finish it. I'm actually very surprised he didn't go for the meaty headbutt yeah. after the reset, right? Mm. He just went raw for the throw. Nice call out there from TB. He's trying to get that Turkish bread, man. <laughs> trying to make that money. All he right. stays eating. All right, got him in the corner, but just, oh! The track down, yeah, James! Yeah. I was about to say he was gonna get out of the corner, but TV definitely chased him down. Nice. Oh, oh yes. no. What a weird slide situation there. I mean, I don't think he had the meter at the time to cancel it, otherwise he would have. I'd have to check that out again. There's yeah. plus frames, though, getting out of the corner. Swiping away the, with the fears, just in case a button came out from TB and the check mm. with the Chariot Tackle EX. What's gonna be the trigger activation? And remember, this is a tricky situation here because we're the first Ooh. round. Oh, nice. Chase down. Here we go. Okay, okay. Now, I like the idea there. Put a little bit of a second guessing in the Somniac's head. Wow, just punishes the V skill. Yep. 
trying to do it within range. Now back to back throws. Somniac is just walking his way a little bit. Yeah. This is kind of tough. A little tough for Somniac. TB does have a charge up the V skill. Oh, and Tyre is there this nice. time. Went for the shimmy there. Nice. And then checks the forward dash from Somniac. And one of the things I was trying to say is remember, this is the top 16. It's still just two out of three. Correct. It is two out of three. So TB now is at one game out from getting into that top eight. I was curious about that sequence as well, right? Somniac blocked an EX Metallic Sphere and decided to dash forward. TB didn't even have to do much to catch yeah. the dash. In fact, TB was confident about the read, dashed forward and ended up getting it with a light <laughs> sequence. That's the kind of read that was like pretty... It, it's, it's one of those reads where it's like, okay, I definitely know how Somniac wants right. to play. Mm -hmm. Like nobody else would want to go in after a blocked fireball like that in that scenario. So he probably knows that Somniac maybe just has a little bit of an aggression streak. Or Turkish Bed was just like, you know, I should be able to go in after this. <laughs> it's a, that's, you know, on paper, it's my turn, right? All right, well, look at this. The surprise chariot tackle finding its mark again. The classic. And so Somniac yeah. tries to return the favor with the... Uh, EX surprise scissors, yeah. scissors, but his is plus on block, you yeah. know, so Bison's is Ooh, good. you love that counter hit sequence. Mm -hmm. Chariot tackle now forward into the corner, back dashing away with the read off of TB's throw. Oh, he no tried anti that anti-air again. Yeah, it was just a little odd angle. Oh, speaking of anti-air, what side stays in the front? That was a big swipe down for Somniac, but still in a life deficit. V trigger Here is coming out go. from TB. Mix up time. He just goes for the washing machine to crouching medium kicks. Oh, oh he was standing. What? We, did he, there was no counter hit? He just ate that. I'm not sure what happened. Possibly pre-jump frames involved. Maybe he chose jump as a movement option. But there you go. TB, is that match point? Or maybe he blocked at the last second crouch. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I, you're right. You're right. But Could yeah, be. like I said, this is this if if TB can take another round here, he's he's in the top eight, and Somniac will have to fight his way through the loser side of the bracket. Oh. Ooh, what an interruption there from TB. Yes. Using his meter very well also on defense. I feel like he hasn't missed too many. He's missed one, but right. since then, he's been exactly. pretty on point yeah. with the X headbutt. He got, he, uh, Somniac blocked it once and one time only. But you can tell that's a good read on the aggression again from Somniac. He wants that win. He's feeling a little bit of that desperation. Mm -hmm. And you see a little bit more movement, more forward movement coming from the side of D TB due to the fact that he is slightly down. And he's he armored might. too, so he can throw fireballs for free. Oh! Oh! Again, that's finding fine. its mark. Oh, oh no! Boy, you and cannot. No, you cannot. Okay, out of there, out of there. Gets to escape that. Okay. He doesn't have the meter for his own V-Trigger because he used that V-Reversal. <gasps> that could have been a big whiff punish for TB. Yeah, there was the attempt at the shimmy. No anti-air again, back to back, third time. And he teched the throw. What a choice to what? make, Somniac anti-airs. But it's still pretty close because of the great life that accumulated. Okay. Somniac is within position and gets it. Yes, sir. You see TB opted for the movement, but Somniac now stays alive. Yeah, I'm not sure what TB was trying to do. He's like, he got hit out of the air. It's like he was trying to jump back or something. He was yeah. in fear of the throw or the command grab option. Somniac read it two paces ahead. Yeah. Getting himself that V up on the top there. But TB is trying to make himself yeah. a little bit less vulnerable to this option, this offensive options from Somniac. And, and Bison, of course, now taking advantage of his off his plus frames. Mm -hmm. Again, as you saw earlier, Psycho, there's plus. He's just plus all the time on all of his best buttons. Oh, okay, finally blocks that. And there he goes, steals a future turn with the heavy kick afterwards. Now he has the activation. Mm -hmm. And again, doing bison things. You see the <laughs> amount of gray life. You see the amount of chip. Uh, TB has not been intimidated yet. Oh boy, wow. that's gotta be something. Okay, Psycho Crusher, that's a smart. I was thinking maybe EX Scissors, but Psycho Crusher will accomplish the same thing and mm -hmm. he's still got some V-Trigger left. Tries the anti-air. Was Dang. that a, that wasn't a cross up. It was, was heavy not. kick from the front. And that was tricky. That could have been a medium kick at that position to get the cross up. Actually, I feel like it was a little bit too shallow to get the cross up. I'm not sure. But that was some super turbo nonsense. That's right? nasty, yeah. <laughs> No Bison. Way, nasty. Anything super turbo that, related? Dirty. He had that heavy kick or medium kick, cross up or not cross up. Even like a, a jump in heavy punch, how he alters himself. Yeah. <laughs> that's even worse. That's not going to cross up. But I'll tell you what, if it does, I wouldn't be surprised. 
But that's got to feel good for Somniac there, getting those last two rounds to manage to tie it up. But Ooh. what feels good is getting a raw jumping combo like that for TB mm -hmm. to drain a fourth of your life. Yeah, speaking of jump fierces again, TB making it work, getting the solid read on a jump in against Somniac. But to be fair, Somniac hasn't been anti-airing everything. So that's why that was such a great option to go no. to that round start. Big punish now, TB again? gets a forward throw. Weird slide timing from Somniac. That's the second time. He slid in a situation where he was confident he was going to get the hit. Yeah, the DMs are closed. Somniac does not have enough life to trade off with that EX knee drop. I mean, it was the right choice. You can win that one, but just a little too late. So he gets the trade. That was not, not what, what he wanted, wanted whatsoever. Oh, I mean, it was weird because it kind of low profiled. But look at that. Spending one of his uh, V reversal bar, his V trigger bars. He got half of it back, but still, it's oh. going to be a little bit more before he gets the full thing. Ooh. Oh, yeah. He had it charged up way, way Here before. Here we go. Somniac is down big. Oh, oh, he's about to be down bad if he keeps taking some more of these trades. All right, here we go. V-Trigger activated. Are you going to go for crazy V-Trigger sequence right now? Fine. Oh, he's going to be able to punish that. Oh, I, he didn't combo into the command he grab. Did not. He did not. That would have led to an even bigger opportunity. Nice anti-air still on yep. point with Somniac. Not in fear of the trade. That's how he lost that uh, a previous round was he just let. Oh, that was wow. wrong. But again, he would have he would have been able to right. get into the cycle pressure anyway. Oh, oh the TB, he had nothing to lose kill. on that one. He had nothing to lose. He had a round to play with. And that was the big bet. TB, the big bet. I'm telling you, man, TBB, actually. But that was such a phenomenal read from TB. Uh, TB.